Look at that arch, I wonder what it's for. Hey, Canyon Blossom here, and how did I find myself at Newer Gallery? It's story time! Yeah, I snapped. Last year, I thrifted some clothes from Instagram. Bibbidi bobbidi boo ended up meeting the owner of that thrift page in person. Then we went thrifting together, just the three of us, through peas in a pod, the third person being blood related. We had a lit time. I was sweating like a pig through those Gikomba paths, the ones in between the clothing stalls. And with secondhand clothes filled guneas hitting my head every eight steps. So very exciting. Oh, and if you're bougie, gunia is sack. The end. Back to newer. The three musketeers were back together to catch up. I tried a strawberry flavored mocktail, non-alcoholic, all that holy stuff. The mocktail was a little sweet, a little sour, great combination. Ah, so refreshing. Nairobi has definitely been hot and this will save your day any day. That's hot. I enjoyed Nuer Gallery Chillside, lots of vegetation, fresh air, beautiful people at sea and it's great for a nature themed photo shoot but maybe if you ask or you can also do a date with yourself solo date there was even a bridal shower event that day Bambino Italian restaurant. That's my friend having her chamomile tea. It smelled really great. This is such a beautiful color on the teacup. I love its shape also. It just makes my soul feel wonderful. I got some baby chicken and fries with a salad on the side. The chicken was a little tough for my taste, but I wasn't sure if that's how it's supposed to be with it being called baby chicken. Aside from that, I really liked the flavor of the chicken. Mmm, some thick fries for a slender gal. The salad was good. I love the flavor of cherry tomatoes. I wish they added a little bit more, but either way, I enjoyed it thoroughly. My blood relative got some pork with some crunchy skin on it. Quite an interesting texture with a side of well seasoned fries, kind of spicy. It was good. <music> Frost Cakery, this was my fifth time there. I love their cupcakes. I decided to try their cake rectangle and one of their milkshake. The cake disappointed me to be honest. The texture was off-putting. The milkshake toast, uh, toasted s'mores vanilla was the bomb.com. 10 out of 10. Would totally recommend. Oh, it's a oh, it just fell. 
<laughs> Camera time. <laughs> Fun times in Chinatown. Okay, see what's inside. Okay. Oh, it's so mushy. That kind of scares me, the slimy stuff. Yep. So you, you're gonna try it first. I'm gonna try. I'm the guinea pig. <laughs> on this one, on this one. Okay. Because you've seen my vlog. I'm seen your vlog. Oh my god. Yes. I know we're after the glory days. Filthy humans. She will not live here. What is it? Okay. She's a cat on a mission. Oh my god. <laughs> She's not responding, she's the first cat in my head It's true. She's the first cat in my head that isn't responding to you. Disclaimer, once upon a time I was a picky eater. New flavors need to grow on the palate, especially in case of a new cuisine. This does not mean the food is bad. For example, there was a time pizza almost made me throw up. But today, I'm a pizza addict. I wanna try, actually I'm gonna Are you gonna try a, a big piece? I'm gonna do I'm gonna take a risk and like try the slimy part first. I'm trying to cut oh it. Oh my god. Oh you can use this to, like rip it apart. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, hold that thought. Let me try. Mm -hmm. And then we'll share thoughts. Okay. I'm gonna stick the whole thing. Wow, let's go. Last impressions? Yeah, no? You hate it, don't you? <laughs> I don't hate it. I'm like, it takes some getting used to it. Like, okay, I, I think I think it's like the aftertaste. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what did they say it's called? Did they say what it's made of? Maybe we picked the, the wrong flavor because, you know, lemon flavor is never the first flavor. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I'd give it a second chance on a good day, like on a bright sunny day like, like when you're super hungry yeah like when i'm starving like three days worth of starvation then i'd give it another chance yeah you know at first i thought okay that's good then the aftertaste right like, somebody just barking me out or something yeah. like when you taste like it has it first tastes like cake mm. like mm. the icing on cake so good. like the sweet icing on cake and then the lemon taste now kicks in yeah. And then now it's stuck on your throat. Yeah. I don't know my taste buds here. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I'm glad we tried it. Yeah. It's always good to have fresh experiences. Yes. And I feel uh, more brave when I'm in. This is your second time in Chinatown, yes. is it? Yes. And it's, you know, at least there's a pretty cut in the scenery. I know, right? That's our audience. <laughs> we also got this. Um, it looks like biscuits, like those, I don't know, those tea, tea scones? Tea scones, yeah. I like it. I like the way it smells. Uh -huh. There's a bit of egg. I'm kind of sensitive to that, but that's just my personal taste. Okay. Welcome back to tasting Chinese food in Chinatown. <laughs> the fact that we both did this It's so far at the same time Yeah, it's intuitive <laughs> That should be like our inside joke 
Mm. We're dancing, we seem happy. Mm -hmm. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I love this. Generally, I love this. At first, the egg flavor that was coming out was putting me off. Uh -huh. But I've gotten used to it. And this is like my second biting. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I love this. So we're in love. Cheese, with soda. Stony. Mm -hmm. She loves Stony. She loves Tony since today. No, you. Oh, oh, that's me. Yeah. Of course. Uh -huh. Your turn. Hi. So we're trying um, the Chinese cake. Is it? Yes. And the highlight of this is that we are hanging out with this beautiful queen. Yes. Enjoying our company, she's so asleep. That's how boring we are. <laughs> she was like, Nope. Tell us how you feel. This one is so much better. Yep, it is, and it's like, or maybe it's just that we're used to our own thing and taste. Yes, so we don't want to like something foreign. So this is definitely closer to home because of like its resemblance to like tea scones. Yeah. yeah. Plus I really like like you used to, you say like the egg taste kill you off. Yes. I like when I can taste the egg and stuff. I do. Yeah. I actually do. So I, I, I like this one. This one is a yay. Yeah. That one is a maybe next time. Yeah. Special yeah. Of yeah. <laughs> This one um, needs a part. Thank you for doing this review with me. It really helped. Usually I feel awkward filming in public, but you helped. Thank you. And we also have to give a big shout out to La Queen. Yes. <laughs> Are you a, a cat person? I am. Um, if I was a pet person, I'd be a cat person. Yeah. Oh my goodness. She is such a vibe. <laughs> Chinatown Adventures. We're exploring Shanxi Hotel. I see the reception. Okay, now the sign is not really. Is it closed? Hi. Um. Oh, it's just the car. <laughs> hey, don't worry. Okay. Um. Hey, we're at Lao Shandong restaurant. Oh, we got it. Oh, and they have such a good background. It's so nice, so pretty. Yeah, and we decided to come here to take some selfies, but the owners don't know that. Don't tell them that. Yeah, I'm like, so we had already tried the Chinese food earlier, and um, yeah, we're not looking to order anything else. I know, and the guy, the waiter came here with chopsticks and like mm -hmm. starters, and I was like, we're not, we're not decided yet. <laughs> like, we'll, we'll, we'll get back to you. We should get going. Going. We'll get back to you. Yeah. <laughs> we should get going. For, uh, here we go again. So we have to just stay. The owners were sitting at the table right next to ours and it turns out we were just describing our whole plan to them because <laughs> when the waiter brought the uh, tea, comp complimentary tea, again, the owners were like, no food, no food. But they were so nice and they told us it's okay, we could stick around and take the pictures that we wanted. We were so appreciative of that. Decided to go to Prestige. It's getting a bit dark, but this this phone is filming pretty well. Look at the picture. Wow, that's so yeah. Wow, look at that big Coke bottle. <laughs> it, it's gonna be my first time at this mall. I've never been. It's so big. Mama kombucha 
it's just a kombucha brand and uh, I think I'll try the strawberry mint mm -hmm. I love strawberry I'm usually kind of icky <laughs> with kombucha because I tried it once and I was just like oh, it's not for me should I just put it in here? Yeah, I, I, I would have rather you go for a large sip, but... A swig. <laughs> How is it? Yeah, no. I've seen that face before. Girl. <laughs> should, I try, should I try the original one? Okay, yeah, maybe you should try the original flavor. So yeah, we have two flavors, strawberry mint and original flavor. So. <laughs> Cut time is seeing that face today, no? This is better. For a person who doesn't like kombucha, this is better. Oh wow, because it's like, it's flavored, it's like that yes. one. Yes, it definitely, the strawberry mint definitely diverts from whatever I hate <laughs> for the original <laughs> flavor. Alright, that's all. Okay. Yeah. Wow, look at that presentation. So this is going to be the last meal of our fun day, I think. It was a fun day. Yes. And I ordered the... Yeah, it was just on the menu and I was like, give me something sweet. What is the name? It, it has like... I've forgotten what it has inside. It has blueberry. a mango. Yeah. yeah. Blueberry and a cut. Here they don't mince their portions. They filled it to the brim, even with to this. To the smoothie. brim. Yep. Like if I move this one centimeter, it's all... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Try it. Actually, it's giving boba. I swear. Good boba. Good boba. It's giving boba. I like it. It has yeah. like, the mango taste. I like that the mango taste is really dominant in, it, in this. Because if it was something else, I'd have been like, oop. And I oop. Like um, acai. <laughs> it's really nice. The acai, acai, acai. Yeah. Yay! She tried something new and it worked out. That's from dark. Some some of dark brown chocolate goes lighter. Awesome, can't wait to try it. Oh, rich, awesome, awesome! Yes, we love to hear it. Mm -hmm. If you like this vlog, subscribe.